In this video, we're going to learn the account reconciliation process in Sage 50 accounting. And this account reconciliation, that is a part of a banking. So if you click on this banking tab, here we have this option reconcile accounts or you can find the same option in the task and here we have this option that is account reconciliation both are same so I want to reconcile my cash account from 1st January till the end of this month the August so I want to check the ledger balances so click on the journal ledger click on this journal ledger double click click on the options select the period this year to date and you can change till the end of this month select a filter to the GLID and I want to check the cash on hand so here we have this the beginning balance that is 75,000 and then cash deposit in no Islamic bank we deposit the cash in the new Islamic bank that is 50,000 and then cash deposit journal that we deposit a cash into Alhana traders account that is our supplier that is 1200 so that is a total that uh, debit side 75,000 the credit side is 51,200 and the remaining balance is 23 uh, 23,800 that is the balance amount of cash available in the company till 31st of August 2019 so I want to reconcile this account now so you need to click on the task and here we have this account reconciliation maximize the window and here in this account reconciliation first you need to select the recon account which you want to reconcile account to reconcile that is cash on hand and then what do you want to see you want to see all the transactions you want to see all deposit and bank credit first you want to see checks and bank debits or you want to see only the debits and bank credits so I want to see right now all the transactions that is a statement date so I want to uh, that we enter till the end of this month and then we have this uh, unreconciled difference so we have a difference of 75,000 that is the same GL system balance that is 23,800 then we have this deposit in transit now what is deposit in transit uh, that transit this is the money that has been received by a company and sent to the bank but has yet to be processed and posted to the account by the bank and then we have the outstanding checks outstanding checks are the checks that a company had issued and record in uh, recorded in its uh, the general ledger accounts but the checks has not be cleared in the bank account so those are the outstanding checks so these are the checks which we already issued right so we issued these outstanding checks so this is the 50,000 we deposit in the Nur Islamic Bank already issued so it is already let's suppose show is is showing in our bank account so you can check this option to clear it that is auto clear that is these are the void checks and uncleared are this one and then we have new banking record and what is a statement ending balance that is 23800 so we have a difference of 51200 so these are the two outstanding checks that we already issued in our books and when we at the end of the month when we check the bank statement and these checks are also presented in the bank so you need to check this option to clear them same for the Alhana traders so if you look here the unreconciled difference that become zero so that is how you do the account reconciliation in Sage 50 similarly if you if there is any interest income you earned 
or if you are paying any bank charges or service charges then you need to enter the amount and you need to select the respective GL account and then click on this option to OK to save it and if you want to check the reconciliation statement for this cash on hand you can click on this report and click on this option account reconciliation so it will show us the report that beginning balance is 25,000 less cash dis uh, disbursement because we paid this cash 1200 right so this is the report that bank reconciliation uh, that uh, bank statement date till 31st august 2019 and similarly we have this unrecon uh, that uh, reconciled difference was 75000 and the en ending balance is 23800 so this is how you will reconcile an account in sage 50 accounting Similarly, click on the save. I want to reconcile Noor Islamic Bank. So go in account reconciliation. Account reconcile. That is Noor Islamic Bank. And I want to see all the transaction. Till let's suppose 30th of this month. We don't have the interest income right now we don't have any service charges or the bank charges so unreconciled difference is this and that is a statement GL ending balance so I'm gonna enter here 75350 enter we don't have the outstanding checks and deposit in transits these are the checks or maybe the cash which we receive from our customers and we recorded in our books but yet not deposited in the bank so in the bank statement it will not show but whenever like at the end of the month or the next month obviously when you deposit after some time it will be reflecting in the bank statement also so but in our bank, uh, books of accounts we already recorded these deposits so you need to check this option to clear them so look the statement ending balance uh, balance is this outstanding checks are zero deposits in transits are also zero that is a GL system uh, balance and there is no difference so this is how you will do the account reconciliation in sage 50 and then click this option to save the account reconciliation for that specific month.